Have you ever wondered what it's like to witness a technological revolution right before your eyes? What if I told you that right now, a monumental battle in the realm of artificial intelligence is taking shape, one that could define the future of how we interact with technology? Just a few years ago, AI chatbots were little more than a novelty. Today, they're poised to become an integral part of our digital lives, thanks to giants like Meta and trailblazers like OpenAI. As we speak, Meta has rolled out its latest AI assistant, packed with groundbreaking features, ready to take on the likes of ChatGPT. Imagine having a personal assistant that not only understands your requests, but also anticipates your needs, seamlessly integrated into the apps you use every day. This is about an AI that transforms your digital interactions into more human experiences. Stick around as we dive into what makes Meta's new AI, Llama 3, a formidable contender in this race. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on those notifications. This is cutting-edge technology you won't want to miss. Today, we're diving into what might be the biggest tech rivalry of the year, Meta's showdown with ChatGPT. Meta is going all in with its AI technology, spreading its AI assistant across its biggest platforms, Instagram, WhatsApp, Facebook, and even Messenger. Remember when they introduced this AI assistant last September? Well, it's becoming a core part of how you interact with these platforms. Imagine typing a question into Instagram's search box and getting an instant reply from this AI or seeing AI suggestions pop up in your main Facebook feed. That's happening right now. Meta has even launched a dedicated website at meta.ai to access this AI independently. What's really turning heads is the launch of Llama 3, Meta's latest AI brainchild. According to Meta, Llama 3 performs better than its predecessors and competitors on several key benchmarks, especially in coding tasks and language understanding. This could be a game changer for developers and tech enthusiasts alike. Mark Zuckerberg, the CEO of Meta, is betting big on this. He mentions that with Llama 3, they aim to offer the most intelligent AI assistant that people can freely use across the world. It's a hefty goal, but with Zuckerberg's track record, it's not out of reach. His strategy leverages Meta's vast scale and rapid adaptability, turning every iteration of Meta's AI into an opportunity to learn and evolve based on real-world use and feedback. Meta AI is also setting new standards with its real-time integration of search results from Bing and Google, a first of its kind. This means depending on what you ask, Meta AI decides which search engine will fetch the best answer. Plus, it now has the capability to generate not just static images but animations and high-res images on the fly as you type. This adds a layer of interactivity and utility that could redefine user expectations. In terms of global reach, Meta AI has been a US-only affair until now. And that's changing fast. It's rolling out to English-speaking countries across several continents, including Australia, Canada, and many nations in Africa and Southeast Asia. This expansion is a big step towards Zuckerberg's vision of a truly global AI assistant. Now, let's talk strategy. This feels a lot like what Meta did with Stories and Reels, innovations pioneered by others like Snapchat and TikTok that Meta adopted and popularized. Some might criticize this approach as copycat behavior, but it's clear that Zuckerberg views Meta's vast scale and adaptability as major strengths in the competitive landscape. By embedding AI so deeply into its platforms, Meta is aiming to make its AI assistant ubiquitous and indispensable. Here's where it gets technical and exciting. Meta is introducing two open-source Llama 3 models to the public. There's an 8 billion parameter model for lighter tasks and a massive 70 billion parameter model for more complex queries, both available across major cloud platforms. And if that wasn't enough, a gigantic version with over 400 billion parameters is in the pipeline. That's a lot of brain power. This allows it to process and understand information on a level that mimics advanced human cognitive abilities. With training on over 15 trillion tokens, its capability to discern and generate contextually relevant and accurate responses is unparalleled. Zuckerberg is even hinting at Llama 4 and Llama 5 as parts of Meta's ongoing AI saga. Despite the fast pace of AI development and potential safety concerns, Zuckerberg believes these risks are manageable and is committed to advancing open source AI. These future models are expected to incorporate even more advanced multimodal capabilities, possibly extending to fully interactive video generation and deeper integrations with virtual and augmented reality technologies. The roadmap includes expanding the context window of AI interactions, allowing for longer, more meaningful conversations with users. 
This could revolutionize customer service education and many other fields, making digital interactions more human-like and contextually aware. This all boils down to one thing. Meta isn't just participating in the AI race. They're trying to lead it, to set new standards and redefine what an AI can do. As we look to the future, the landscape of AI is one of both promise and challenge. Meta's strategic initiatives and developments like Llama 3 are setting the stage for a more interconnected and intelligent digital world. The journey of AI is far from over, and as Meta continues to push the boundaries, the world watches eagerly to see how these technologies will shape our digital and physical realities. So what do you all think? Is Meta's AI push going to put them ahead of ChatGPT and other AI technologies? Or is this just the beginning of a much larger battle in the AI space? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more updates. Till next time, this is AI Nexus. Catch you in the next video. Peace out.